wanted to show you a neat uh, feature in iOS. Oftentimes, um, I find myself a little bit disappointed with the on-screen typing. And uh, although I wouldn't want um, a physical keyboard really on my iOS device, it would be nice to be able to type a little bit easier. This feature is built right into iOS, so it's already on your um, iPhone or iPad, and it's called Keyboard Shortcuts. So what it does is it expands shortcuts that you set into full words, phrases, or even paragraphs right before your eyes. I'll show you how this works in an example here. Uh, now I'm using the app called Drafts on my iPhone, but you could use this uh, in any app on your iPhone. So let's uh, say we want to insert some Chinese text uh, instead of English. And we've got a shortcut already made for that. So that shortcut is uh, T email C. Now you can see it automatically prompts us if we want to change that into the phrase that we've created uh, in the shortcuts menu on the iPhone. So if we just hit space, it'll insert that Chinese phrase. So let's show you another example. This is a little bit longer one. This is to uh, send some instructions to someone. So I've created a short call, shortcut which is triggered by typing I I N S T U R U. Oh, and see it's already uh, seen that that uh, phrase or that shortcut will expand into this phrase. So if I hit space, it now has in inserted this entire uh, phrase that I've already configured in the settings of my iPhone. So these are a couple of the um, cool ways that you can use keyboard shortcuts. Here's another one that I use a lot and you might uh, too if you find yourself sharing uh, web addresses you can put those into the shortcuts. So for one I've got APC and it'll automatically expand into appchasers.com. So those are just some examples of how I use keyboard shortcuts on the iPhone. But you'll be able to uh, think of your own, I'm sure, ways that you want to expand text that you often type. Another one that I use a lot is expanding my email address. So just typing in a quick shortcut will automatically insert my email address, which is useful for uh, filling in forms on different websites that you come across or creating um, accounts on websites that you need your email address as the username. So how do you exactly add these shortcuts or create them on your iPhone? Well it's all done within the settings app. So click on settings then scroll down to general scroll down to keyboard and then at the very bottom you'll see the shortcuts. So there's some that are already populated here on your iPhone uh, by Apple, but you can go ahead and create your own. So we'll just show you how to do that. Tap on the plus icon in the upper right. Now the phrase here is what you want the text to be expanded into. So let's try just a fake email address here. We'll say um, email address at gmail.com so that's what we want our result to be. And then the shortcut we can just say E-E-M-A-L. So now anywhere we type E-E-M-A-L, anywhere on the iPhone, will expand into our email address. So we'll hit save. We can say that, see that that's right there and we can edit it, edit it at any time. Now let's go back to our drafts app and we'll show you how that expands. So E-E-M-A-I-L and there it is, email address at gmail.com. We just hit space. You want to remember that if you're inserting your email address uh, into a form on a website, you want to backspace because that will automatically add that space at the end. So you just want to backspace. Now that's only if you uh, are doing this for emails. But that's how you use the keyboard shortcuts on iOS. I'd really like to hear how you use them, and you can leave that in the comments below.